Hey lightweights and welcome back to some more Horizon Forbidden West. Last video we just did side quests and errands, so this video we are going to continue on with the main story and go to Pharaoh's tomb. Um, last video I tried to do one of the parts of the quest which said to go to Fall's Edge. I don't remember why I had to go there, but it didn't lead me to anything. Um, so I'm gonna leave that for now and just go find Alva, which is the other part of this mission. Um, and hopefully the Falls Edge thing, since that's it has the Roman numeral two next to it, maybe I'm supposed to do that after. I don't know. Um, so hopefully I can do both of those, but I did wander around there again before I started recording and I still couldn't find anything. So we're just gonna go straight to Alva if we have time after this main video, after this main quest during the video, we will do some other side stuff. Um, but the main quests, as you guys know, tend to be pretty long, so um, I might really only be able to do this one. But either way, I'm very excited to see what is in the tomb, um, what we're gonna learn from that. I'm excited to be with Alva again and learn a little bit more about her people. So I'm just excited to continue with the main story. Uh, thank you guys for being patient as I did side stuff for the past two videos. If you are new here, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post my next video. And if you're returning, if you like what you see, feel free to hit that thanks button below and donate a little extra cash if you got it. But every view, every comment, every like really helps and I appreciate you all. So without further ado, here we go. This is pretty. Is that a building out there? Like a dilapidated one? Oh boy. I said we won't do much here. Okay, so I do have. Where's the key component? See, I thought their tails were what I needed for things. Do I try to kill them or do I sneak past them? Let's just go for it. What's the worst that's gonna happen? Okay, I was gonna say, wait, did it already? Did it explode? I don't think it exploded. Oh. Fuck. All right. Oh. Okay, stop trying to tear off component, just kill it. Oh, it just goes right away. Oh. Where's the third one? It's running away. No way too far. I had to try. Should be just past this beach. A lot of people must have just come through here because there's like a path. Hmm. 
And that's safe, just in case. I don't have to fight those things again. They weren't bad, though. Um, these plasma arrows do... Do a good job. I don't know what the difference between these two is. Advanced plasma precision arrow. Just more damage, I guess. I don't know. Oh my goodness, this is farther away than I realized. Sometimes the mounts are just like more work than they're worth. Because <laughs> they're hard to to navigate through things if it's like the areas that have the bridges or the forested areas with trees. But this is a pretty open road. I probably should have just been riding it the whole time. It's fine. Oh, this way. Okay. Or not. That's fine. I'll go by foot. <gasps> What the hell is that? Why can't I scan it? Why can't I scan it? Why can't I scan it? No one here. That's strange. Well, nothing's stopping me from taking a boat. I mean, I'm pretty sure that thing is. All right, I need, to, I need to scan this, though. Okay, let's go hide in some grass. I can't leave without scanning this thing. That would just be stupid. A slaughter spine, good. Yep, sounds great. Mm. Not fighting that right now. What's this? Why is this just rolling around for one of those kangaroos? Bristleback? Why would my bristleback? How did my bristleback get hurt? What the hell? <laughs> that seems like a very long boat to row on to row to row on your own. Especially against the waves. I guess if you know what you're doing, it's probably not difficult. I tend to just like go sideways in a canoe. Like, can't keep a straight line. Like, I'm just like, Meh. I better go find it. Should be to the northeast. Okay, where am I? Damn, we went a long way. Anything in here? Pretty area. I'm running low on uh, ridge wood already, so we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna gather more while it's right here. I just love how everything is just like reclaimed by nature. Hmm. 
Oh, shit. <laughs> Hello. Fire class riders. Weak against purge water. I don't... Wait. I can mount that? Wait, 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 wait. No, you don't see me. Look away. Look away. Oh. I don't care about you. Why are you coming over here? There's nothing to see here. Shit. That's not gonna work. Okay, I just wanna... I wanna take it over. Where'd the other one go? Oh, it's over there. Okay, we're gonna do that one. Because I'm pretty sure it came down through there last time. Right. What? Why are you stopping there? Shredding jaws were enough. Walk down. Oh boy. Oh boy. Don't walk this way. Oh yes! Oh yes! Sweet! This is cool. Oh, we're jumping on shit. Okay. Um, I just want you to- I just want you to run, please. This is cool! There's a chest over there that I totally just ignored. I looked at it and I said, not today. So these are the ruins of Central Got the campfire. City of crumbling towers. That's so cool. Is it just following the road without me? Do these just follow the road? You guys, I'm. I didn't know that. This entire time I've been playing, I didn't know that. Is it just going towards my marker, or is it just following the road? About something. What happens if I go faster? I can't go faster. Okay. I hear something scanning over there. I guess this is our stop. This is really cool. Look at the water erosion and stuff. So this is like the area that was in the trailers. And the not this area specifically, but... The San Francisco area must be, because this is what the trailers look like, I think. With these skyscrapers and trees and stuff. Is that her? The living ancestor. The diviner wasn't lying. This is landfall, right? I'm looking for Alba. Overseer Bohai ordered us to invite you before him should you approach. Please, come with me. Go. Let him know we're coming. Diviner was right. Damn, those are some nice ships. Overseer Bohai, a stranger just walked through the gate. I'm not a stranger, I, I am Alba the stranger. You do look like Sobek. Is Alva here? I need to talk to her. I will consider your request once it is determined what you are. A living ancestor as Alva believes, or a threat lurking in such a guise. I am no threat, okay? 
Back on the mainland, your soldiers fired on me without warning. So you say, infidel. None of those you engaged survived to bear witness. I held off on your squad when... What? May I present our honored CO. So, here she is. Our great mystery. Well, Bohai, what have you divined? What is she? A mystery indeed, my CO. How can she appear as Sobek, and yet know nothing of our ways? Are we to believe that a living ancestor was born to this wretched land, an ocean apart from the realm of the Chosen? And if so, to what end? I cannot answer. Only she can. But I warn you, no falsehood will satisfy us. Now speak. I don't think any truthhood will either. Why are you here? What is your purpose? I'm looking for a place called Thebes. And what do you seek there? Alva told me a little bit about what you're after. I guess you could say I want what you want. A way to heal the world. As I suspected. Tell her. <laughs> we found Thebes. The final resting place of Ted Pharaoh's secrets. It isn't far, but the way is closed to us. Machine attacks have cut us off from the site. Diviner Alva is there, along with a complement of diggers and soldiers. Is she all right? Our scouts tell us that a machine has our people pinned behind their defenses, but they're holding out. Machines, huh? I can help with that. Alva told us that you are indeed formidable. But I have a few questions first. We will answer what we can. So you found Thebes. How? The ancestors revealed it to us not long after we made landfall, almost a year ago. Through a scrap of ancient data discovered by Alva and verified by myself. It contained details about the construction of a great underground palace. Where, exactly? Close. Beneath the Great Pyramid in the ruins beyond. Figures. Ted loves his pyramids. Have you been inside? Uh, no. <laughs> that has been a problem, one of many. And we will solve them all in time. Getting back to the site is the one at hand. I hope you're as effective against machines as Diviner Alva suggested. What exactly are you looking for inside Thebes? I thought Alva brought back the data you needed. We risked much to cross the ocean. Therefore, we must unearth every possible link to the legacy while we are here, especially one as important as Thebes. We will not sail back until I have plundered its secrets. So it's not about saving your people. You crossed the ocean on these ships? Couldn't have been easy. Greatness is never easy. Indeed. It took seven years just to build the flotilla. This expedition is the most important undertaking of our generation. A quest for knowledge across the gaping sea with nothing less than the fate of our tribe at stake. And none of it would have been possible without the will of the CO. The voyage was difficult. The wilds here even more so, 
Our sailors and soldiers have suffered much. I know that. But all for the glory of the Quen. Good to know. <laughs> Just like you guys are crazy. So, Alva reports to you. I was chosen by my colleagues on the board of overseers to supervise data retrieval on this expedition, yes. And you're in charge of the expedition? He is far more than that. You are addressing the cousin of the Emperor of the Quinn. Heir to the vast holdings of the Great Delta, the first CO in five generations. All she needs to understand is that I am the authority here. And my will is to attain the secrets of Thebes. Mine too. We're in luck. What kind of machine has your people pinned down near Thebes? A Thunderjaw. Oh, good. We've good. dealt with them before, but this one is... Tougher, stronger, and it has black armor? Yes. How did you know? <sighs> Doesn't matter. Won't be easy, but I can take it down. Then destiny shines upon us, as I knew it would. A living ancestor now walks among us, and she will help me attain the secrets of Thebes. Resupply here if you must, then on to Thebes at the base of the pyramid in the ruins. We will follow when our scouts confirm you've cleared the way. Oh, thanks for the help. Appreciate it. Bless you. A stomach line is a muscle strength. I wonder, did Alva say how long it took to get here? They said it took seven years to build the ships, but clothing for all purposes. How long did it actually take to arrive here? And do we know where they came from? To be a diviner is to be both deeply blessed and solemnly responsible. As scholars on the infinite wisdom of the ancestors, the commoners look to us for guidance. We must not forsake our duty to counsel them, however trivial their concerns and predicaments may seem to be. Let this primer serve as a touchstone whenever they are in need of inspiration. If one is beset by fatigue or hunger, tell them to look to the spark, Nikita Arand, the ancestor who gave rise to our great empire. Through her wisdom, we overcame stagnation to live in abundance. If one is beset by a malady of malady or hardship, tell them to look to the healer, Song Zhao, the ancestor who defied notions of illness and death. Through her wisdom, we strive to push past our physical restraints and live in vigor. If one is beset by anxiety or trepidation, tell them to look to the protector, Eric Visser, the ancestor who embodied strength in uncertain times. Through his wisdom, we dominated our enemies to build a better future. If one is beset by envy or bitterness, tell them to look to the patron, Peter Shifumbe, the ancestor who advocated for transcendence of humanity, inhumanity. Through his wisdom, we stifled dissension to form a society greater than the sum of its, sum of its parts. If one is beset by apathy or hopelessness, tell them to look to the renewer. Dramatic ending. Okay, where am I going? I'll get that rumor off camera. Those are usually just like bandit camps and stuff. Okay, off to the big pyramid to fight the Thunderjaw. Another drone keeping watch on the biosphere. I should grab its data. But how am I going to get it down? I don't know. We'll worry about it later. This is cool. The ruins just feel so real. That I don't know if that's the right word, but. They did a great job with them. A barbarian! Run, stranger! The machine There's a killer will kill machine you. about! 
Very well. Why? I guess we're doing this. Oh boy. I don't think I have anything that has purge water. <laughs> I also need to get its guns and shit off. Fuck! Okay. Yep. I want to have one of these going at all times. Jesus. Guns off, didn't I? Why am I not using those? What? That was it. weapon, two more, show up.
Oh my god. Whiff, whiff, whiff. All the time, whiff. Jesus! Okay. <laughs> that sucked. <laughs> Killed that machine. Your CEO sent me. I need to Come speak over, to all the... A word. Alva, I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you got rid of that machine. But what are you doing here? There's something inside Thebes that I need. I went to Landfall. I met your CEO. We came to an agreement, kind of. And you're going to help us get in? I guess so. The whole thing was a little tense. There was something off about that guy. And I don't understand what he wants from Thebes. I thought we found the data that your people needed back on the mainland. That data will take us years to sift through. The CEO wants faster results. Aloy, you have to be careful. He's- There they are. The legacy tells us that Elizabeth Sobek helped the ancestors cast aside all obstacles. And so it has been today. You have been true to your word. I'm pleased. Thebes awaits us below, shall we? He looks familiar, but I can't pinpoint what he looks like. Or who he looks like. Much of this was flooded. We had to pump a great deal of water out. Behold, the door to Thebes. A door like no other. Well, you're right about that. It's designed to open for only one man. Ted Pharaoh. But the legacy tells us that he worked closely with Sobek. He trusted her. Surely she could open the door, and so surely can you. Not gonna happen. At least not from this side. You said she was a living ancestor with Sobek's eternal essence. Uh, if I may, Pharaoh, great as he was, did not build his palace alone. We know this from scraps of data we found, the ones that pointed to this location. And we found evidence of passages below. Maybe they were built to aid construction. Or for servants. We can't reach them. The way is flooded and they're too far underwater, but... I... Yeah, I can reach them. There might be another way in down there. You see? With Sobek, there is always a way. Then do what you must to get us inside. Nice save, Elva. Nice save. This water is warm. <laughs> What is it? Is that lava? What the hell? Don't get too close, don't get too hot. I'm assuming I'm supposed to go towards the glowing light. There's a rupture up there. Maybe a way in. Yeah. This could get me inside. Is 
This is creepy. Hey, looks like this tunnel leads deeper into the structure. Um, through the fan? Okay. I'm impressed it's still working. <laughs> That'd be a horrible way to go. Now there's another one. No. Aloy. What is happening right now? What? What's going on? Why am I stuck? Why am I stuck? Jesus. That was so weird. She like can't swim here. What is going on? That was really bizarre. I'm inside, but how do I let the coin in? Nice little home gym. Looks like an exercise room. Here I am again. Hiding in the gym. Writing to stay sane in this crazy place. I can't believe Gregory's dead. Our so-called spiritual leader was fine yesterday and then suddenly passed away in his sleep and no one will talk to me about it. They treat me like a child, whispering behind my back as if I can't cope with death even after the end of the world. Who's that? I loved doing um, these in the last game because learning the story of each one, like each one had like a different, I don't know, subplot to uncover almost. And I loved that. The living area. It's pretty big, too. There's nothing normal about a scientist, his daughter, a guru, and, well, let's face it, a harem living through the end times in a trillionaire's underground survival bunker. But now that Kagori's gone, I'm worried things will get even weirder. He helped keep Ted stable for a couple of years, sort of. Without him, who knows? And we don't even understand what happened to him. The girl's right. Nothing normal about Ted. Oh, I thought she meant that she was Ted's daughter. Did I tell Ted what he needed to hear or only what he wanted to hear? Did I want to lead him to salvation or was I simply seeking my own? I invited him to consider his being in a universe bereft of the trappings of techno-nihilism. But did he instead annihilate his own past along with the rest of the world? Oh god, what have I done? What? 
<laughs> what did you do? That's a cool little living room. I know everyone's reeling after Grigori's uh, untimely demise. He was a deeply spiritual man who wasn't afraid to rip back the curtain and gaze where few men dare. I've asked Dr. Somtau to, you know, check on what happened to him. I'm sure he had some kind of condition or something. The main point is that while we certainly miss him, we will go on. Everything's gonna be okay. Yeah, something tells me it didn't turn out that way. Based off the conditions in here and the fact that there's nobody living, I'd say so. Maybe he killed himself. For a second I thought Ted killed him, but the diary entry didn't sound like that. Let's hope this is the way to the main door, so I can let the Quinn in. Well, it's the only way, so odds are good. <laughs> Look at this place. What? Pretty fancy for a survival bunker. He really did fancy himself a pharaoh. <clears throat> there, the door. Let's hope I can open it from the inside. Ah, good. An emergency exit function. Emergency exit finished. Door is open. Destiny is upon us. I knew you could do it. What's going on? The CO is preparing to enter Thebes. What? Oh, why are you dressed like Ted Pharaoh? I am Pharaoh, renewed. My essence is the same as his. Across the years, across the generations, his soul is my soul. His will is my will. We are sundered in only one way. I need his final testament, his deepest secrets. And now that the door is open, those secrets are within my grasp. When I have them, I will be complete as he was i will have everything i need to save our homeland and as pharaoh did the world mm. okay i think there's some confusion here about who pharaoh really was no one knows better than i who he was who he is me the renewer greatest of the ancestors the man who saved the world. And you. You understand, Sobek. You are her. Pharaoh's harbinger. His assistant. <laughs> Come. The fuck did you just say to me? into Thebes together. As it should be. Bring her the raiment. Raiment? As he is Pharaoh, you are Sobek. For an occasion, this momentous, shouldn't you wear proper business attire? Whoa. No, 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 no. No, I am not wearing that. No way. You will wear the proper attire to mark this moment. And who's gonna make me? Or what? It is said Sobek valued life above all else. Is this true? Fine. I'll wear your raiment. This guy has so many screws loose. They look comfortable at least. Shall we proceed? She seemed itchy. 
Look at this place. The grandeur. Fair oh, like domain. Simply breathtaking. Excellent. Somewhere in here, Pharaoh left his secrets. Let's go find them. Your Magnificent. Perhaps we should leave guards behind to cover our exit? Indeed. Let us be done. What a weirdo. Most of Ted's women repulse me, okay? To think. They're like contestants on a housewife sim preening for the hubby's attention. But Brianna, the hollow singer, she's different. She's always been nice to me. And I love her voice, which has been conspicuously silent since Grigori died. She doesn't speculate or gossip like the others. She knows something. I can tell. Mm. And I'm going to find out what it is. Ted Farrow's reality TV show. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. We're definitely going to have to fight something with no armor. Pharaoh's visage, a monument to great Humble. He's very Ooh. humble. It's a monument to something. I'll give you that. So, what are we going to fight? <laughs> Bitch, get in my way. Why is everyone in my way? Watch out. Sobek, coming through. I think this way might lead down. Excellent. Remember every detail of this, Bohan. It will be its own chapter. My god, they like to hear themselves talk. No less than he deserved. Of course. Brianna told me that Grigori hacked into restricted files and found out something awful. That Ted murdered important people who worked on Zero Dawn. Did Ted punish Grigori? Kill him for discovering what he did? How could that be? Dad said... There wasn't a mark on Grigori's body. His heart just gave out. Find anything Wonder interesting. Wonder if Pharaoh had a footprint in here. I I've can't make sense of it yet. There will be. Oh fuck! <laughs> Sorry. Hey, this is weird. Yeah, I tried to warn you. Yeah, sort of. I'll explain everything if we survive long enough. Those certainly look threatening. Ah, statues. Are we gonna have to fight the corruptors? The guardians of Pharaoh's domain. I don't think they're guardians, or I don't think they're statues. <sighs> Those aren't statues. Look out! Get the CO out of here. Guess it's just us then. Come on, Ted. Chum down. Oh, happy to see me. No choice. Keep your guard up. Um. Oh, right to the face. Don't. We can spare. Okay. That's not working. That's not working. That's not working. Holy shit. I'm on fire. Okay, that was crazy. It wouldn't have been difficult if there wasn't, like, nowhere to go. <laughs> Thanks. Where's Overseer Bohai? He has decided to return to the surface. A wise choice. We can't afford to lose any more diviners than necessary. So, 
No more delays. We must proceed. Brianna didn't wake up this morning. She's gone. Just like Grigori. I'm looking up at the giant. Did you discover some data? What? A uh, fragment. A, a testament to Ted's power. Ah. Okay, let's go. Is his name CO like like a CO? Like cuz he's thinks he's Ted. When I built this place, when its special systems were designed, I knew what I wanted. Protection, of course. An unlimited power source that was a given. But also control over every possible eventuality. After all, you never know what will happen, especially when the human element is involved. What did you find? Trust me. You don't want to know. I guess I don't. So a way to kill people if they decided they didn't like him anymore. Oh my god, I just looked down at the baby monitor and baby late is art sideways like this, just staring at the camera. <laughs> Definitely not creepy at all. What is that? A reclining throne. Attached to some kind of apparatus. Yeah, sure. I wonder what it does. An impressive setup. Why don't Was you lay in it and find out? I'm sorry, CEO. I don't know. My focus can't read the data here. What about the living ancestor? Is the data lost to her? I never thought Ted would actually do it. I assumed the whole thing was just to scare me, to keep me under control, to show what he might do to Kanya if I stepped out of line or screwed up his treatments. It certainly kept me motivated. What does that say about me? About us? There's so few of us left, and we're still keeping secrets from each other. Such terrible secrets. Somtow. Okay, so is he, he must be the doctor then, and Kanya is his daughter. How can I explain to him that you can't really prove an organism has achieved immortality in a day, a week, or even a year? The question literally embodies the idiom, only time will tell. I have no idea how long his body will survive. All I know is that it will last a lot longer than mine. As far as the therapy goes, we've graduated from two steps forward, one step back, to two steps forward, one step sideways. With each treatment, his cells regenerate more effectively. At this point, I don't think they're aging at all. But mutations keep popping up, and each one has to be treated individually. So far, my strategy of pharmaceutical whack-a-mole seems to be working, but for how long and with what side effects? The irony is, I've probably achieved more for the fields in these last two years than the entire industry did in the last 20, but no one's around to appreciate it. Ted sure doesn't. These days, he doesn't seem to appreciate anything. Why would you want immortality when the world is destroyed around you? I guess when you're an egotistical nar narcissist, you don't really care about the world. Scan the device, if you will. All right, hold on. You did this for him? You put, like, off switches in everyone's heads? Can you? You mustn't judge me. I had Please, no choice. If device. I said no, what would he do to us? What would he do to you? You're my little girl. I was trying to keep you alive. For what, Dad? Seriously, why? 
So we can be trapped in this Tell me what underground your focus nightmare? reveals about the device. You know what we have to do. Please. Did you find a recording, Aloy? Mm. Yeah. I'll share it with you later. You definitely do not want to hear it now. Let me tell you. What? Hold on. Where is that chest? Scan the device. You, you loser, just need to shut your mouth. You will get your scans when I'm ready. Made a minor adjustment to the gene therapy regimen and added a new cocktail to treat the symptoms caused by the mutations. Hopefully, there will be some stabilization after the next treatment. God knows what Ted will do to us if there isn't. The early results were so promising. No signs of aging, no cellular degeneration, but now... Oh, if only I had access to my old lab in Bangkok, or my old colleagues, or my old liquor cabinet. Stop it. Got to stay positive. For Kenya. You saw something. I could tell. Did the data explain what Pharaoh used this device for? I think he was undergoing treatments to live longer. A lot. Longer. Why would we tell him that? Could he still be alive? Don't be foolish. If he were alive, he would have kept his essence. It would not have been passed down to me. Remember, he was the renewer. Of course he would have stopped at nothing to grasp the secrets of life and death. But not for himself. Everything he did was for a new beginning. Okay. For us, for the Quen. And for his true heir, me. You know, I'm starting to think you're right. You do have a lot in common with Ted Farrow. I knew you would see in time. Let us continue. His secrets await. Hmm. Is that a small office for a minor functionary, perhaps? Oh, I hate this guy. He is insufferable. Lots of data points. An automated geothermal energy plant right under the city of San Francisco. A marvel. Even I can run it. And let's face it, I was always more of a visionary than an engineer. Look at all this. Which is why I had the foresight we are getting closer to, to the insist heart of this on the place. inclusion <laughs> of a very unique feature. Just in case anyone ever tries to steal my cheese, so to speak. Okay, structural integrity low, core vulnerable, any disturbance may trigger safeguard protocol. Sounds great. The door down. I'm going to look for another way in. Good idea. It's worked before. Very well. Get to it. She's gone. Did you make it to the other side? Can I just like not let him through? <laughs> Is that an option? 
A console. Maybe I can access Ted's files from here. He's the one feeling sorry for himself. Less his future. Less his children. Someday they'll come. And I'll be here to greet them. Sometimes that my aging has stopped altogether. If anything, my cells are replenishing faster than normal. I just need some time for the mutations to calm down. Time. And energy. Some tests of the reactor can give me what I need to grow strong again. Does Ten and Resident Evil? So I can greet the kids. They're gonna need me. My advice. My guidance. And then I won't be alone anymore. Pharaoh's secrets. Are they here? Uh, not the ones you're looking for. No, oh God. Then they must be in there. Trust me. You don't want to go in there. Are you mad? I haven't come all this way to stop now. Oh god. <laughs> ah! At last, Pharaoh's legacy is mine. Burn it to ash. Wait, no. Pharaoh has it rigged to melt down if- Kill them too. No witnesses. What? Where'd that guy come from? Into battle. Hit her! Fuck you, dude. Oh, God. Ow! the face, bitch. Feral rig 
through Damn. the reactor to overflow if he dies. We have to run. so stressed and love it so much. Is dead. Oh, good. Hang in there. Jesus. Still in this fight. Barely.
Good riddance, asshole. Are you okay? What happened? We, uh, we found something that will help. Not just your homeland, but everywhere. But where's the CO? Well, oh, he's gone. I guess you could say he gave his life to help us attain the secrets of Thebes. I see. You must think I'm eminently stupid. What? No, no. The CEO was an entitled egotist who twisted our beliefs into a sickening, self-serving fantasy. And you expect me to believe he sacrificed himself for scraps of data? It's time for the truth, and it better be convincing. Otherwise, I'll simply order these soldiers to open fire. Hold on. You're right. To be honest, the CO screwed everything up. He brought Thebes down around our ears and died like a gutless coward. But we really did find something down there that will help your homeland. If I can take it and use it. Now, if I have to, I will fight my way out of here, but it doesn't have to be that way. You can just let me go and then take credit when things start to improve. She's smart. Success certainly does sound better than failure. It seems then that our destinies are intertwined. Landfall is open to you. If it will help your cause, you may come and go as you please. But Alva must join you and report back on your efforts. Fair enough. Thebes is of no further value to us. Obviously, we're going back to the flotilla. Alva, I expect your reports to be thorough. Oh, I thought he was going to have us killed. <laughs> oh, and instead, I get to join you. Glad to have you. But you're going to need a little help to reach our base. Varl, I made a new friend. I need you to meet her at the Quen Ferry and escort her back. On it. Can't wait to meet her. I love how our little, our little group is growing. Varl will give you a better focus and all the data you could ever want. Head to the ferry. I'll join you back east as soon as I can. A diviner must follow the truth wherever it leads. I'll see you there. Yay, more friends! Nice! Now that I have Omega clearance, we should have what we need to capture Hephaestus. But before I head to the ferry, maybe I should stop by Landfall. With the CO gone, maybe more Quen will be willing to talk. Might be worth looking around the island, too. I gotta change out of these clothes. I can't believe the CO made me play dress up. All right, guys, I have to stop there. That quest was so cool. That was so cool. Um, I wish we got to see what Ted actually looked like with all his mutations and stuff. Uh, that's a little disappointing, but it's cool that he actually was alive, if you can call it that. I guess technically he was alive, but was he living? I don't know. Um, and it was really cool seeing the story of his vault um, and seeing how his egotism and narcissism contributed to his downfall. Um, oh, baby lights in full melt on mode, so I gotta keep this short. <clears throat> um, and the storyline was just really fun. I had a lot of fun with this quest, and I hope that you did too. I'm so excited to keep playing. I'm just freaking loving this game so much, so much. Um, if you haven't already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so you know when I post my next one. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I hope you have an amazing day.